And the thing that we've looked forward to most out of the deck build pack, the final Centurion card to make or break this deck is here. Make sure you smash the little crap out of that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out on more awesome content. And blah of oath. Let's make a promise to come back together in one piece. I'm not going to lie to you. I like the story that we've got developing with this. It's just literally two girls and the robot that they use to fight with. Uh, so in terms of what we've got going on here, we got another quick play um, spell card for the deck. And uh, this is this is all right. So quick play spell card. No, activate one card with this card's name per turn. So activate one of these effects. So we can place one Centurion monster from your deck face up in your small trap card zone as a continuous trap card. So that way you'll be able to trigger special summon it and continue on with your day. But if you use this effect, you cannot special summon from the extra deck for the rest of this turn. While you control a card that was placed in this card's with this card's original name, except for Centurion Monsters. You know, they. It stinks that you can't do the Calamities lock with this. They're going to lock you into Centurion Monsters for the turn. I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. Um, there had to be some sort of catch, right? Getting the ability to get an immediate place and then, you know, start comboing up. I get it. It's uh, it's a little bit broken. Or we can set a Centurion Spell and Trap directly from the deck. So you're going to get you get one of two effects. I feel like this card needed to do more. I understand that right now the way that the deck is, it's it's literally just Calamities Turbo. At this point, you get the level 12, you get the Crimson Dragon rolled on out, and then you attempt to make sure the opponent can't play the game. And the fact that they did give the deck a beam out for something is good. I just think at this point in time, we need another Synchro. We need something that maybe is a little bit lower in levels that we could actually be able to use. Um, then we will eventually get another uh, support line or two for this. They've done it in the past. It's just looking at what we've got right now. I don't know. It just feels like it's a little bit, just a little bit more, and we can have something. I just, I don't know what more they can give to this deck. It definitely feels the best of the three in the deck build pack, but I like the card. I like the story that they're telling here. I think that this is this is a good step in the right direction. So we'll wait and see. So what do you think? Please leave a comment down below. Tell me what you guys think. I'll see your beautiful faces back here in day, guys. Peace out. Patrons, thank you. Uh. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. Check out these other videos.